Let's take a quick look at how we can leave voice comments for our students on work that they've created within a Google Doc. Here's a sample student assignment completed within Google Docs and turned in through Google Classroom. Of course, I'd like to leave my students some feedback, and I can do that in a variety of ways. But one of the more interesting would be to use voice comments. That simply means recording short audio clips of your voice giving feedback to the student. This can be done really easily using a Chrome browser on a computer. We need to use an extension called Read and Write for Google. Once you're logged into your district account, you will have access to this in the top right hand corner of the Chrome browser. Simply click on the purple icon and then select the puzzle piece to bring the tools into view. Once you see the tools, all you need to do is find the portion of the document that you'd like to leave the comment on and highlight it. You can highlight a single word or even an entire paragraph. We'd like to add a voice comment attached to this paragraph. So with the text highlighted, I'm going to click on the Voice Note button in the Read and Write for Google toolbar. This brings up a microphone icon, and if I click on that, I can begin recording my audio comment. When I'm done, I simply tap the Stop button. I can use the Play button to play back my audio comment to make sure it sounds good, and when I'm ready, simply tap Insert. You'll then see your comment appear on the right-hand side of the page along with the highlighted text. Students can tap the Play button to play that comment back. I can begin recording my audio comment. This is a much more engaging and personal way to leave feedback for students within works that they have created in the Google Suite.